Applewax. Relax, will you? Relax, 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 in the Lego shed, do you want me to give you a quick tour round? So, um, I've we've we've swapped we've swapped um, we've we've swapped sides. So I was down that end, but now you can see all the the gym stuff is down that end, uh, and I'm now in front of this window uh, instead of the other window. Um, and uh, I'll just I'll just show you. The, the situation we've got here now. So I've got a longer table here now for doing filming. Um, and then I've got storage and then all of this that boom, 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 boom. And uh, as you can see, I've now got a considerable amount of space now. So I'm going to have, um, it's, it's on its way, I'm going to have a, a standing build table that, 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 that's here. Um, but there you go, the Liza Minnelli and Falcon uh, ongoing project. Uh, some bits fell off it as I moved it. That's got to be fixed. Anyway, there we go. So that is the new uh, new layout in the Lego shed, um, which I hope will will work out rather well for us. Anyway. Uh, there it is. So it's bag five today. Let's get on with it. Um, I do believe we uh, we have Julia uh, thingy log Dreyfus Elaine um, oh she's got a fuming face there look at that she's got a, yeah, oh, oh let's make her happy come on we've got we, we've got a new s scenario shed oh look at her isn't she fabulous? Yes, thank you. Okay. Uh, we'll pop you. We'll just pop. I'm just popping her straight on set because the, the, I'm feeling that vibe. Kramer's on set, so he's fine. Um, now, look at this. I don't think we've had this before, have we? Or have we? Mm. Uh, Professor Lego, do tell us. But obviously, it's a goldfish bowl. Um. And she gets to hold that. Again, I don't know the significance. Our resident Seinfeld experts will tell us, I'm sure. So there we are. Elaine, thank you. Uh, thanking you. Right then, off we go. Wasn't, yet, I mean, yesterday's show was absolutely rammed. It had everything, didn't it? I hope you enjoyed it. Little Sue. Oh, no, sorry. Sorry, little Sue. Sorry. We're starting with the Google eyes today. Sorry. Sorry. Stand down, little Sue. You're not up yet. Um, it's TVZ. A TVZ. <laughs> Says, I don't have a Lego shed. I have a card table. And when I've built things, I just put them somewhere in the house. The wife, the mermaid, finds them and never fails to say, what have you put that there for? Yeah, I mean, it's it's... It's a never-ending um, battle. By the way, FYI, um, uh, I'm going to have shelves put up as well. Shelves, shelves, because I, 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 I feel you can never have enough shelves. And I'm going to get more storage uh, boxes for bits and bobs, because I have got, I have got a, a rather large um, pot now. That's full, well, it's not a pot. It's more a crate that's full of things that are going to be taken apart. Um, 
which I will do more of when I've got my standing up desk because I find I find sitting down for long periods it's, it's not it's not good for me it's not good um, sorry I'm just concentrating here because it's slightly finickety there's, there's finickety things occurring here and I'm but I'm in grave danger of really properly mucking up, so I'm just doing a little bit of tethering, which I'm sure you're all delighted about. So, oh, oh I see, it goes like that. Right, thank you. Gosh, I'm glad I tethered in then. Couldn't be gladder. Couldn't be, g oh, oh, stop everything. You know what's coming. For every set I long to build No matter when or where or who Has one thing in common too It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a hinge It's a hinge Every set I ever build, every set I ever do Every set I've ever done Every set I'm going to, it's a hinge. It's a hinge. Fa 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 Oh, hang on. I think it goes the other way. Ooh, I think that one goes that way and that one goes that way. Oh, cr well, we'll see if I'm right or if I'm wrong later, I suppose. Right then, back to the Google Eyes. Eric, it's got a duck of Basil. They both like watching Lego. And they really like musicals. Oh, his name is Eric. F -f -f -fum, etc. Uh, he says a Commando 8 is the model of air conditioner that Kramer um, uh, bought for Jerry. He installed it in Jerry's window but didn't seal it in place. It later fell and hit a dog on the street. This episode is actually sometimes used in lore schools to help illustrate liability. No, really? Grief. We'll just remind ourselves of the, uh, here it is, look, the, uh, the Commando 8. I see now why it's hanging out the window. Well, that's clever, isn't it? Uh, Vandalay Industries, George Costanza, sometimes used the nom de plume Arthur Vandalay. He originally used it as a fake company name for a reference on a job hunt, said he worked for Vandalay Industries. Later, he used the name Art Vandalay a lot, like Phoebe on Friends, used the name Regina Philangi, and Karen on Will and Grace used Anastasia Beaverhausen. Hashtag a Seinfeld trivia. I mean, that was excellent. Well done. That was excellent trivia. That was absolutely phenomenal trivia today. What? A, how informative. <laughs> so good. So, so good. Uh, TVZ. Uh, tooth news. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do we need to brace? Uh, my gum is, is almost fully healed. Bleh. Huzzah. I'm able to chew soft food. Uh, well, sort of gum it on the left side of the gap. I've got to go back later on in the year and have a post screwed in. Which will be a fixed, a fake tooth. Not looking forward to all that palaver, but am um, looking forward to having a full gob's worth of gnashes again. And also... Oh... Uh, uh. Well, I'm very glad that you're on the men TV, Z. I'm very, very... The mermaid must be delighted. Delighted. Um, Danny Bowers. War! War! I said, oh, the null tune. Dying. Yeah, that was uh, Ray's anthem. It's good, isn't it? It's good. 
I, uh, as the crow flies, I have no idea uh, what what Noel music I've played today. Absolutely none. Might even play his anthem again. I don't know. Don't know. Don't know what will happen. I'll have to wait and see. I'll see how the mood takes me when I'm back in the big house and doing all the editing that is required. Uh, Eric says, trying again with the wreck story. <gasps> the wreck story. Since it went completely missing two videos ago. I was surprised to see him respond to my tweet reply to Little Sue because I know he doesn't know about RWB. What? 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 The woman who is on at the radio station before me works as a regular job with social services. Rex works with her helping foster kids and family adoptions. Oh, he sounds bliss already, Eric. He first started following me on Twitter, told me he works with Kathy at Social Services and listens to and likes my radio show. Oh God, this is, this is exciting. Uh, then he made a friend request on Facebook and we've chatted on social media a lot. He's uh, the same age as me. We were set to go out for a drink one week before Ohio went into full lockdown in March 2020. So that never happened. Oh, that's such rotten luck. The thing is, I'd lost 45 pounds through 2019, kept it off until the pandemic. I've gained 50 back and I feel like a total cow. And I'm now too nervous to ask him out. Oh, no, no, Eric. Eric, weight can always be lost, but days cannot be seized when the days need to be seized. Come on. I mean, he might have gained 50 pounds. You never know. And so, and it doesn't matter anyway, uh, it, it's gaining 50 pounds. You, you're, you're lovely and gorgeous and beautiful, whatever weight you are. Uh, plus, he says, since we've never met in person, only see pictures, and I've never even heard him talk, he hears me on the radio show, obviously. What if it's all just wishful thinking? Well, you have to give these things a go, Eric. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out, but you've got to give these things a go. And most gay men are very shallow when it comes to other gay men's bodies. It's why I have very few gay male friends, because most are so rude and mean. Well, uh, mm. So like I said, I wanted to ask him out again, but now that I'm a big cow again, I'm too nervous. Well, I, I mean, are you still chatting to him? What, what's, what's the whole situation? Please, please, please. We, we need to know what the whole situation is. Is he still chatting to you? Uh, is, is there any, you know, what, how, how's he fed during lockdown for, for heaven's sake? What goes there? I feel like we. I feel like you're giving up too soon on this. Um, we must not give up on this. Uh, excuse me. I mean, what if it all works out brilliantly, and uh, he becomes your your gentleman husband? What if that happens? You know, stranger things have happened, Eric. I mean, let's lest we forget. I'm married now because of Twitter to Georgie Gobon because that's because of Twitter so you know come on come on Eric don't give up please and if you're if you're feeling I mean God knows I know I, I know this feeling I my weight yo-yos up and down like a blinking barrage balloon um, but the thing is is if if you are feeling uncomfortable uh, in in your own skin etc then um, there are things you can do if you if it makes you feel better. But honestly, it's 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 just about be, feeling your best self, and and feeling your best self often often has absolutely zero to do with what what your weight's currently doing on any given day. Honestly, trust me on this, Eric. It's about being happy, and about being uh, fulfilled. And it's about all of those lovely things that you deserve in spades because you are an absolutely tremendous man. And quite frankly, 
if Rex doesn't like you because you you've you have become more comfortable over um, uh, lockdown, then I'm sorry, he doesn't deserve you. So there's that as well. Thanks. If he's if he's a, sh a, sh a shallow puss, he can sling his hook. Thanks. Off you go. He's not for you. So you know. I, I, I say seize the day. I say just see what's what and seize the day. God, I, I mean, this is so exciting. Can you imagine if you get married to him? Oh, my God. Oh, my actual God. I mean, it might happen. It happened to me. Um, come on, Eric. We, we, we've all got your back. You know you can do it. Uh we thought she was from Canada and then we didn't think she was from Canada and then a da da she was from Canada. It's Joe. Ooh, William B. Sorry, why well, just remember, Eric? Just going back to Eric. Uh, well, I just remember, and this is only if you want to do it. This is only if you want to do it. Um, a friend of mine uh, did Noom, N-O-O-M, which is an online app. Uh, and she's done very well with it. And it's not just like a, it's not like a, a weight loss thing. It, it, um, it's like a, a, a holistic, all-encompassing thing. It's, it's, it's. It's about the psychology of, of eating. Anyway, she's done very, very well. She's lost absolutely heaps of weight. I mean, heaps. Of, like, she can't even believe it in six months. She, she cannot believe it. Uh, in fact, you can, if you want to, you can go and see her transformation picture. She's called Jamie Klinger, K-L-I-N-G-E-R. She's on Twitter. And, um, and she often posts her before and after photo. It's honestly, it's like you wouldn't recognise her. And she did that in six months. It's unbelievable. Anyway, as I keep saying, Eric, that is only if you want to do it. Something's gone badly wrong here. Something has gone badly wrong. It's gone badly wrong, badly wrong. Something's gone badly wrong. That. That went badly wrong. Oh, sorry, Krim. Oh, oh, Lord. Sorry. Right, there we are. I fixed it. I fixed it. I fixed it. Thank you. I fixed it. Right, back to Gillian B. So it's, it's called Noom. N-O-O-M. Noom. It's a, an app on your phone or oh, I suppose on your laptop or wherever you get your apps anyway Jamie Klinger J-A-M-I-E K-L-I-N-G-E-R go and have a look at that if, if you feel in, if you need inspiring uh, Gillian B do a great anthem and have time shall we wow hearing my comment from Friday really described the chaotic joy I, I was feeling I was I was I was in chaos. My my joy, Emma, was was in absolute chaos. It was chaotic joy. That was me. Well, okay then. Enjoy your poutine. That's it for me. <laughs> little Sue. She's called Little Sue. She's little and she's called Sue. She's little Sue. Yes, hello, it's me again. Yes, hello. I mean, I bet, I bet you thought that you were going to see me until we got to the Twitter wire somehow, but if I am. Yes, here you are. Here you are. Yes, uh, here, here, here I am. So I just wanted to say uh, to Gillian uh, B, we thought she was from Canada, and then it turned out uh, she was, we thought she wasn't from Canada. I mean, get it right, little Sue. We thought she, we thought she was from Canada, and then. We thought she wasn't from Canada, and then it turned out she was from Canada, I remember. So, yeah, well done. Go on. Anyway, I absolutely love Gillian B's comment on Friday. That was it. That, that's, what, that's all I wanted to say on the Google Eyes. Press the button. <coughs> Says thank you. 
Thank you, little Sue. Uh, it was in absolute chaos. Chaotic joy. It was, I was, I was a hot mess. Okay, that'll do. Yeah, uh, a hot mess, Emma. Press it. Press it. Yes. <laughs> she was a hot mess. Um, okay, now we go to the Twitter, right? Yeah, it's, it's me up first. I know it. I, rem I remember because you made a mistake and I know I'm up first. Yes, yes, you are correct. Um, uh, I want to just uh, have a quiet moment, please. Do you remember where the, the, the haunted table was prior to the big moon on the other side of the shed? Yes. Uh, can, we, can we just, can we, okay, I mean, because, oh, no. I, uh, will you look at the sunshine coming in through that window now? Mm, let's have a look at the sunshine coming in through that window now, shall we? Yes, look. See, look at the sunshine coming in through that window. Yes, and also at the cleaning products. So we're thinking of doing some running. Yes, the cleaning products are on the. Are going to do some running. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yes, it's. Anyway, I just wanted to. I just wanted to say, Emma. Oh, by the way, is is that Mr. Triggs's? Yeah, look, it's Mr. Triggs. I'm a thing up there. Yeah, and look, I m I moved vending machine. Don't point me your finger. Sorry. Sorry, I'm really sorry. Anyway, I just wanted to say that I shall miss the sunlit sea with the occasional glimpse of a shadowy bee slash wasp, a shadowy bush as a said bush, swaying in the breeze, Georgie Goblin out the window, and anything else that happens to be inside or outside the window. I shall reserve judgment. Until we see the new film location. Press the button. Well, we still have got. I mean, we still have got a window. Uh, I mean, it's filled with pots. Those, these pots might move. They might move. So, you know, you know that they might move. Uh, but at the moment, they're here. Thank you. I mean, it's a lot of pots in your window, isn't it, Emma? That, that's not a euphemism. Yeah, there's a lot of pots in my window, yeah. Uh, Eric, oh, Emma, I don't know how you missed it, but I typed up the Rex story on the Google Eyes, and you never read it. Oh, good God. I mean, this is terrible, isn't it? It's, t it's terrible when that happens. It's terrible. I'm reminded, of course, of TVZ's epic story of the tooth that took three goes. And uh, and she gave up and she just abandoned it. She literally abandoned it. She, it's like she dropped the story down a well. And just abandoned it. Uh, but we did get there in the end, I do believe. Oh, dearie me, this feels like it could be a mistake coming. Ooh. 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 Oh, okay, fine. Thank you. Thank you for coming to my very minor panic. It's now over and has concluded. Thank you for coming. Oh, thanks for coming. Hmm, I wonder what this is. I can't immediately tell, can you? But look at this. That's a long tile and I don't think we've ever had a white one that length before. Hmm, I better press it. I better press it. I mean, I'm not sure because obviously we have just done the space shuttle, but that feels unusual to my eye. Um, Eric, okay, I just looked at the video of Bag 3 and my whole comment on YouTube about Rex is gone. What the hell? I will try to write it again and hope it doesn't disappear again. I, I mean, there's no, no, there's no rhyme nor reason to what happens on the Google Eyes. Is there? None. It's a mystery. Um, yes. Uh, we saw the you needing uh, space for things. Yes. Well, are, are you trying to turn a page? Yes, I am. Have you finished? Yes, I have. Well, maybe an extension could be built on the Lego shed, Emma. It could end up looking like the Burrows or Topsy Turvy, to Topsy and Turvy, Emma. It could be very Topsy Turvy. Mm. 
and I think that that could 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 work. I have included a pictorial uh, representation. Mm. Mm. How would I give up? That? I mean, obviously there would be stairs in sight. I think. What I? You're not a bird, are you? No, I'm not a bird. No. You haven't got wings. No, I haven't got wings. No. You're not a fly. No, I'm not a fly. You haven't got spider skills. No, I've got no spider skills. No. Well, don't you? You're stairs like any normal person with two legs with no spider skills or wings. <sighs> yeah, it's basic. Press the button. Okay. Mm. Yes. Um, guess what? I do. I, I we've we've got. I think we've got some. We've got a, a mass of stickers incoming. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Oh, this is all encompassing. Will you look at this? I mean, obviously it's a fridge. Right. Sticker number ten. Let's do the stickers first. Sticker number ten. And it is that way up. It's upside down. Sticker number 10. I don't know what that is. I'll show it to you. Right. So sticker number 10 is going here. Ooh. What is it, do we think? And sticker number 15 is going below it. Oh, it, this. I think this looks like a, a cat mitten. Oh, it's mittens. It's oven. It's oven gloves. It's oven gloves. Look, that's a that's a cat. It's an oven glove. Yeah. Cat oven glove and person oven glove. It looks like okay. Then sticker number eleven, which looks like it's got Superman on it. No idea why. And a speech bubble, and a thing that says Yada, and a to do list. We love a to-do list, don't we? Boom. Yeah. And then sticker number twelve, which is which is a long one, which could go wrong. We've got a long one here. Oh, will you look at the length on that? Oh, thank you. Thank you. That's a long one. Now, do you remember the fridge in Friends? And I said that needs stickers on it. That is that is good stickerage. That's what you want, isn't it? That is what you want. So that is going on there. Oh, I think that's very good. That's nice. Okay. Lovely. Um, Rosie. Uh, Rosie Lee uh, says most excellent uh, Afawak anthem uh, from Ray Van Driver had visions of the gooses marching behind Mother Goose in our uniforms twirling uh, batons. Uh, Tanya now dressed to, to, uh, to uh, says twirling doodars. For example, I don't. Uh, surely yes. Do 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 do. Mother Goose. Mother Goose, ba 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 Mother Goose, Mother Goose, Mother Goose, ba 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 etc. Uh, Rosie, I too must confess to having never seen an episode of Seinfeld, but I continue to watch RWB as a distraction whilst I cycle virtually home from work in order to lose those lockdown pounds before returning uh, to the office. See, we, we, we've all padded out. Um, please note, Eric, R Rex might have padded out. You don't, do, do you even know what he looks like? Do you know what he looks like? By the way, Eric, do you know what he looks like? Ask him for a photo. Oh, I wish we knew what he looked like, don't you? Crumbs alive, I need to know everything about him. I, I need to know everything. I need a stool sample. Uh, for Gillian B. We need to know everything about him. We need to know his nutritional requirements. We need to know everything. Uh, ra 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 raven driver ra raven driver ra ra raven driver uh, says, your minifigures, uh, take or take not, would be good to have them for a safe photo. 
as in not on a ride, e.g. placed in front of a fab and or poignant display, you find, then wrap them up and safe back in the bag till home, used daily over approx nine years, still got his hands. Mm. Mm. Oh, do you mean you, you take him wherever you go uh, for a photo? Mm. I'm not sure. Never thought that. And him here. Yeah. Uh, Professor Lagout, uh, we can have a pal to name the Stingray, but I gained the, gained the impression you were sold on Lady Penelope when it was suggested. Yes, I think you're right. I think you're right, Professor Lego. It is Lady Penelope. Yes, it, it's it's Lady Penelope. Yeah, it's Lady Penelope, don't you forget it. Yeah, it's Lady Penelope. Uh, just say the word, though, and I'll go back and note down all the suggestions that the world has said. Now, I think, well, we'll just stick to Lady Penelope. It's fine. If there were any other poll request beyond naming the stingray and selecting an anthem, please let me know. I may have been somewhat distracted catching up on Brooks and Poissos after the last couple of sets. Thankfully, the Seinfeld is offering a bit of a lull there. Um, I think, I think the only one we need is uh, the anthem. To decide the official anthem, uh, I think. Uh, Mike, uh, formerly known as Toby Mori, J. He got the wrong email. Um, he says, uh, oh look, I think it's a micro wave. Uh, the Marvel Street scene has expanded and the bridge battle is now complete. Hashtag more marvellous Lego incoming. Oh, that's very good. Will you look at that? Yeah, it's a nice set, that bridge, isn't it? It's lovely. Uh, ra 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 says literal blockbuster uh, movie idea. All the Lego on Earth suddenly is self-aware, turns against humanity. Every piece ever made joins forces. Lego becomes a sentient enti entity, can move and work together, form massive monsters, structures, flow at speed, minifig armies, global attack. The Lego is all being controlled by an alien hive mind. Um, the, the human race has to fight for survival against Lego. My working title is Dogot, uh, Danish for die well. I mean, I, I mean, I would watch this. But also, I would be terribly conflicted as to whose side I would be on. Um, that's, that's potentially a problem. Yeah, look, it's a micro ave. Micro ave. Uh, Alan Twitwoo Ellen Harwood says the new mo mother goose infiltrates the hive mind, causing a catastrophic domino effect of very minor panics. Subsequently, Professor Lego introduces a pole, which results in all Lego being pushed off a table with predictable consequences. I mean, I would, I would, I would watch this. I would one hundred percent watch this film. Uh. So there it is. There it is. Um, I need to see a pic. I'm just thinking about Rex. I'm, I'm, my mind, my mind is elsewhere now today because because of the, because of the Rex thing. <sighs> we need to know everything about him. Everything. Professor Lago, as for the anthem poll, could the anthem creators reach out to me, please, with a copy of the submission? I think the poll ought to have them accessible. So all the Afrox can listen to the choices before voting. Uh, then, then there is some uh, just some internal admin betwixt uh, betwixt the uh, the entrance and Professor Lego. We don't need to go there. We don't need to go there, gang. We can we can leave them to their admin. Uh, TVZ. I want to see. I want to see. Uh, that opening anthem was the sh it crumbs alive. Yeah, it, it's good, isn't it? It's really good. It's very good. It's very good. It's very funny. Um, I love I love that he he tricked me into saying crumbs alive. It was all part of his dastardly plan, of course. <laughs> crumbs alive. <laughs> uh, uh, Neil, he hasn't got a theme tune. Uh, says, can we please just take a moment to honour the goose barnacle? There's no need to name names or speculate as which goose it belongs to, but I think a moment should be taken 
Uh, hashtag Afflewax Forever. Uh, hashtag Goose Barnacle. Uh, this is this is a picture from from Lego Lost at Sea, still smiling despite the goose barnacle uh, stuck to its chin. Mm. Oh. Goose Barnacle. Uh, Neil, uh, it says storming anthem, halftime show. La Renzulli arrives. All the excitement, more please. But hopefully no fanfare needed for the dappled sunlight through the Lego shed window. Hashtag moving places. Uh, hashtag the important things. Look, look, we have, we, look, we have got, look, some dappled light is occurring. Um, so I will learn, I will need to learn at what time of the day the sun appears in this zone. Um, I'm yet to work that out, but anyway, it's nice to see there is sunlight coming in now. Uh, brace, brace, brace. Says, so how's about if I make up a story as you build a 2D to her and get out your Star Warming effects and get some intrigue, romance, and conflict happening? You did so on a set a while back. Can't remember the bell, but the story was hilarious. Parented, parentage issues, affairs, etc. Let it rip. Oh yes, that was the that was the uh, the donut shop, was it not? The 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 opening of the donut shop, I do believe. Uh, Boss and Nancy, hey mother goose, uh, please build the boom box. Looks like a lot of fun, and we could use some laughs. Uh, yeah, all right. Yeah, boom box request noted. I better put put that in the book of requests. Hang on. Gosh, we haven't got out the book of requests in a while. It's over here now. Oh, I have to get up to get to it because I've got a bigger table now. This is the big table. Book of requests. Thank you. Uh, for newbies, uh, this is the book of requests where I am contractually obliged to uh, fulfil them uh, when they go in. Um, oh, look, wear the Batman helmet on Live and Bricking. Oh, I must remember to do that. Um, oh, it's the John Barry McLaren Senna GTR. <laughs> Build Medical Centre. Haven't done that. Oh, still got to do the Tim Tam Slam and jazz up the Batman la lift crab oven. Oh, I can't remember what that was. Might have to be reminded of that. All right, so uh, Boston Nancy. Boston Nancy. What is it? Let me have a look. The boom box. The boom box. Build it. Please. All right, okay, it's in there. It's in, in the book of requests. It is entered. It is entered. It is entered. It is entered the request book. Uh, I like all of the anthems. Keep them all. Play on a rotating basis. Paka, paka, paka. Yes, I, I kind of feel like um, that's what we should do. So uh, if we're having a poll for the anthems, uh, let, let's just do the order that they rotate in, I suppose. Yeah. Or we don't have a poll at all. How's that? If, let, let's not have a poll. Let's not have a poll. Uh, let's not do it. No, let's just not do it. Let's not do it. Let's not have a poll. We'll just have we'll just have the three in rotation, like we do the um, beginnings um, of uh, the RWB beginnings. Let's just do that. Let's just do that. Sharon Renzulli. Sharon Renzulli. Sharon Renzulli. Sharon Renzulli. Sharon Renzulli. Sharon Renzulli. Says yo, elated to be behind the Nubal Bush at ten four. Uh, Rosie says, uh, oh, welcome to the Temple Show. And she says, oh, my bad. Yes, you are there. A fabulous Rosalie Yee. A nice quartet. Uh, Mike says, hashtag the dream team. Uh, if, uh, did, um, I just want to say that if, if anyone over at the Temple of the New Best Friends sees any fizzy pops or snacks, because I can send my, my mobile cafe bicycle uh, over there. Well, it's already, it's already there. Look, look, it's already there. Ooh, it's already there. 
Oh, I know what, I know what. Let's have a poll as to when we play the anthem. When do we play it? That's what we need to decide. Um, we will have all three uh, anthems in rotation. But when do we play it? Can we have a poll for that, please? When, when, when must the anthem be played? Thank you. Um, I will take your, your guidance on that and decisions. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, Sharon Renzulli. Uh, 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 Sharon Renzulli. Uh, since behind, being behind the bush, I've become a vegan. I did not see that coming. I, I didn't I, I didn't see that coming <laughs> but thanks so you're a living doll uh, yo this sign was up for years on the parkway in Brooklyn who says we ain't got no je ne sais quoi yeah a uh, damn four and uh, uh, will you look at that it says leaving Brooklyn forget about it forget about it that's super that concludes uh, the business of club. Right, yes, so uh, just to confirm, just to confirm, uh, Professor Lego, to confirm, um, we will rotate uh, the, um, we'll rotate the, the anthems. I think, I think, I think pop, pop them in your poll, pop all three in your poll, uh, but we just need to decide um, when they are played. Yeah, I think that'll do it. Mm, hang on a minute. Oh, it goes like that. Okay. There we go. There we go. Because I suppose, you know what, these things shouldn't be a competition, should they? There shouldn't be a competition. It's creativity. Everyone is, is being marvellous. And uh, we should celebrate that always, I think. Boom, 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 what's this do we think? It's got a bottle in it. Dum, 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 dum. Obviously I'm still thinking about Rex. What can we do? Thank you. So I can't help wondering. Maybe Paul Rex is sitting at home thinking, "Oh, oh, I, 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 I'm feeling a bit, I'm feeling a bit rubbish about myself, so I don't want to go on any dates." Maybe he's thinking that too. <sighs> We've all been there. We've all been there. Dum 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 dum. No, that's just one. Hmm. Oh, we've got one of these situations again. Corner. corner. Anyway, you'll be pleased to know that yesterday when we turned around the shed, we, d we, d we, we managed it without having a single crossword or, or, or uh, a sort of any sort of emotional eclipse, which we felt rather proud about. Though we did have to have wine at the end of it um, on a school night. Uh, that was the only downfall. That was the only thing. That went slightly awry. Uh, we were forced to have wine on the school night, but that that was it. Other than that, I think we did pretty well. Me and Georgia Gobble. Yeah, they're all going that way. Okay. Anyway, it's nice having this bigger desk. I'll say that. And I'll be very happy when I've got my standing, my little standing desk so I can do uh, builds and animations while I'm standing up rather than sitting down. That would be great.
Again, don't know what this is. Look at this now. Yep. I wonder if it's a hob. I thought we're putting some of these things on. Oh, it's a cooker. I like how that bottle's down there in that corner, don't you? That's a nice little touch, that. Yeah, look, it's cupcake. I don't know what that's supposed to be. What do you think that's supposed to be? Bit of bread, bit of cheese. That's going. Oh, it attaches there. Does it? Oh no, there. Let's get Kramer out of the kitchen, thank you. Um that's a very nice little kitchen. That's very nice. That's a lovely piece of design. Um, okay, final little bits now. Got another hinge. It's a hinge. It's a, it's a, it's a hinge. Oh, I did not see this coming. Okay. Little stool using those candle bottoms. There's one. I think this is a better design than the uh, friend's apartment. What do you think so far? That's there. That's really nice. That's lovely. Um, super. That's it for today. That was bag number five. Lovely. Um, I just think if I got any anything official, I have to tell you. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. So just for double double triple check, we do we the poll for the anthems is when do we play them? When when must I? When must I uh, play the anthem? Um, we could, I mean, we could have, uh, actually, do you know what would be, what might be nice? We, we could have the, the, the knolls on a roll, uh, uh, with the anthems played during the knoll, uh, on a rolling basis, like we do the start now. We could do that. We could do that. Or at the end, but that would mean waving goodbye to the glorious Jackie Swan's recorder music. Um... Although we could add that into the mix as well, so that that could that could be on a rolling thing with the anthems. So yeah, all right. Let let's say this: we can either have it in the knolls, the anthem played during the knolls, or we could have the anthems played at the end. Jackie Swan's recorded music will also be in that mix, so there will be a rotation of four on that. Um, or anthems are only played at, at special occasions. Um, we need, sort of need to know what those that special occasion would be. Maybe maybe at the beginning of a new build. Mm. So much to discuss. I've just seen the biggest spider in the universe. And on that bombshell, I will love you and leave you. It's right above me. Athelworks forever. See you tomorrow. <laughs>